All right, I have my goggles on and I'm ready to play. My name is Sloth154 and welcome back to 3 out of 10. This is episode 2. Uh, I forgot what it was called. But as you can see, the robot has a gun. The intern, this might be another one who's in a cage. They keep their interns in cage is a bit scared, which I would be as well. Uh, let's see. We have DEFCON Tennis, so I think something bad's about to happen. But this is a game exploring the daily lives, the the lives, not daily lives, the lives of the worst gaming studio in this fictional world. In real life, I'm not gonna say name because they might try to dox me or cancel my channel. So let's hop into this. My office hours are never. Foundation 101. CIA hug. Okay, let's hop into this. Kevin, get your ass in here. Francine? What's up, Francine? Oh, hey, a new shipment of interns is here. Oh, Just God. Just in time for poker night. Really? Poor interns. I hadn't noticed. Now get these damn things out of here, please. What's with the wall of interns? The mailman just started building this around me. That looks surprisingly stable for, you know, being built of interns. Hello in there. Are any of you particularly meaty? The programmers love the meaty ones. Oh no, not this again. You can't just feed interns to the engineers whenever you need something. Uh, that's how it's always been done. It's called the circle of life. It is not. Francine, back us up here. I don't care what you do with office supplies. They're not office supplies. They're people. And Look, everyone in this office is complicit in murder. Then no more sacrificing interns. We can't just do nothing with the crates. After a couple weeks, they start smelling. Well, I don't know. Return them to the sender. Hey, you in there. Me? Yeah, you. What school are you from? Center of the Institute to the uh, Academy of the Higher University of Games? You don't know what school you're from? It keeps rebranding. Just check the return label. Center of the Institute to the Academy of Higher University of Games. Huh, here in town. He wasn't kidding. Hey, they're here in town. Great. Let's just go there, give them these crates back, and tell them we don't need any more interns. Knock yourself out. I've got better things to do. Fine. Okay, well, we can't carry all these crates ourselves. Let's recruit some of the others. And then, we're going back to school. I would not work there, even if it killed me. You all do what you gotta do. Just make up the time and I don't care. Okay. Try to recruit Ben. Hey Ben, you up for a field trip? Uh, sure. I have to wait for my lighting to finish baking anyway, so... Excellent! Alright, we got Ben. Hi Julie! Do you want to come with us on a field trip? God damn it! I'm recording! Stop it! Okay. I guess not. Well, Julie... I'll actually meet her, I guess. I'm not opening this fridge ever. Oh, yeah, uh, there's something living in the fridge that has tentacles. And I think its name is Sally, because it's right there, the sticky note. This fight begins now. Oh, I love this cereal as a kid. Hug and butt. Hug bots color dot cereal. That's a star. Ah, got the star. For some reason, there's rubber ducks everywhere. Definitely don't recruit Jeb. Play Shark Game. Fantasy novel number three, the Archon, blah, blah, blah. Not going to read that. You guys can pause it and read that. Intern closet? No. Looks a little hazy out there today. Well, at least the protesters aren't back. Hi, Viper. We need you to come with us to bring back all these crates. I don't do errands. Uh, it's not an errand. We were hoping you could help us, you know, Convince them? them? Whoa, whoa. You mean like you need some muscle? My snot kicking radar just dinged. Your what? My snot kicking radar detects the likelihood of snot kickery happening. If there's going to be any snot kicking, 
I need to be the kicker, okay? Hey, combat scenarios are all yours, big guy. I'll go yeah, get my Viper's crowbar. the artist, but he's a bit intense. Oh, they cleaned my desk. This map sure is handy. Uh, do, do, thing, Deb, Kevin Pylon. Kitchen, storage closet, dumbwaiter, Deb's office. Hey, help Timothy, bot. Do you want to come oh, with Timothy. us to return these pet crates? I'm sorry. I can't do that. The AOA. I wonder where John is. And this is the gateway to hell. I can't believe they were putting interns down this thing. Yeah, uh, the developers of this, the engineers for this company, they've gone feral and they eat the interns. I don't know what will happen when we stop feeding them, but, you know. Let's see what Jeff has to do. Hey there, new employee. How's your first week going? Don't tell me. I actually don't have time to listen. I've got to get in the right mindset for signing things. Uh... That means you leave my office now, new employee. When I'm signing things, I get really in the zone. It's like I don't even know you're there. Okay, I actually do know you're there. Go away. Well, forget you then, Jeff. I'm not going to play the shark game because it's stupid. Hey, Joan. Joan, could you help us bring all these interns back to the center of the Institute to the Academy of Higher University of Games? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm still banned from that campus. Uh, What'd you oh. do? Too bad. Uh, no, you're not just gonna leave me there. Tell me what you did. This isn't over, Joan. But yeah, uh, last episode, this desk was covered in blood. What the hell? Is that a... This map sure is handy. I'm not trying to look at the map. I'm looking at the spike cover bat there. What the hell? I had hell? no idea there was a game design school this close. So I couldn't find my crowbar, but I brought my bat. You yeah, can't bring that, that bat. on a college campus. It's an essential piece of sporting equipment. Okay, dude. It's covered in nails and says Bloody Mary on it. Seriously? Bloody Mary is a character from my favorite game, Sweaty Blood. You watch your mouth when you talk about her. I really don't think we'll need that, Viper. You're scary enough without it. Yeah, I am. I can turn anything in my environment into a weapon. See this seatbelt? I could make you choke on it if I wanted to. Um, why did we bring him again? No one is going to choke Why does he anyone. have his crowbar? We're just going to show up, hand them these interns, and leave. There won't be any violence. They always say that. Yeah, I'm expecting violence as well. Objectives. Don't lose interns. Collect all the stars. Oh god. Uh, where are we going? Oh god. Did we just jump a train? We're hemorrhaging interns. I lost an intern. I got two stars. I'm not gonna try to get better. Where did half my team go? They went out to some college to go return some interns. We have interns? Not anymore. Well, whatever. Francine, I need you to hold all my calls for the next half hour. You don't I'm get calls. I'm signing things, and I need to get into the zone. You don't get any calls? I need focus. Hold my emails, too. I guess Why I the fuck aren't router? you wearing right. shoes? Absolute focus. That's how you get stuff done. CIA. Oh, that's what it meant. 
Looks pleasant enough. We lost a couple Don't of interns. Don't see too many students, though. Man, it's a video game college. You expect anyone to be outside? Fair point. All right. There's probably some kind of business relations clerk or something. Oh, there's a tour. Let's ask the guide. We come now to our Is that a robot with missile arms? Building, named after yours truly, in honor of my record-breaking dedication to our shareholders and students. Do you actually make video games here? Don't be ridiculous. That's unhygienic. But you train them for real game development, right? Because what little Robbie wants, little Robbie gets. We adhere to strict principles. Your little Robbie's going to end up in jail. Including a rigid curriculum of theory. The more rote task of learning which buttons to push is delegated to our robust internship program. So many big words. Impressive. Wait, you're saying you don't even train the students? Our instruction is of the highest quality among schools with a similar accreditation rating. Oh god, is this a for-profit school? Your questions are making me uncomfortable, so I'm going to ignore you now. Wait, who are you all? You look old for prospective students. It's right. never too late to go back to school, okay? Not if you have good credit. Why do you have a robot? Oh, that's my automated recruitment assistant. He's not ex-military, and don't you dare imply that he is. He He's has missiles for arms. Agent. Sweet missiles. Uh, studies show that there's a direct correlation between missiles and enrollment. Look, that's we're just called here to return coercion. Our interns. You keep sending them to us, or and we don't want them. We're from a game dev studio across town. Uh, Midge doesn't want us to keep feeding them to the engineers. Engineers have to eat too, don't they? That's what I said! Are these game devs? Like, real game devs? You make Cool Border! My son wants to work on Cool Border! I thought you said you had 100% job placement among graduates. We do! We're creating a workforce for tomorrow! Our guaranteed internship program directly leads to job placement. We've never hired any of our interns. Oh, we do use them as poker chips sometimes, though, which is close. Recruitus Maximus, escort these hecklers off campus, would you? Affirmative will destroy. Eh, quick, scatter! Wait, what? Oh no. Uh. Uh. Okay, there we go. Alright. At the last of minute, I'm gonna get these people killed. Okay. I'm sorry, man, I'm stupid. I got three stars. Cool. Again, I'm All not right. trying to get five stars on this safe. stuff. Uh, where the hell are we? <sighs> Lost. Where's everyone else? Weren't they behind you? I wasn't running, okay? I was chasing you. Man, I didn't say anything about that. Look, military grid robots weren't part of the deal. You can't snot kick a robot. Man, let's just get out of here, all right? Yeah, whatever. Okay, this campus can't be that big. We went down the hill, then between those two dorms, then into here. Hey, intern, do you know where we are? I've never been to this part of the school. Hopefully the others will go back to the car. So we find the car, wait for them, Rubber get the hell out of here. All right, so which way is the car? Could ask the old dude in there. Hmm? What? Man, Whew, that thing was terrifying. I know something Where got hacked. God, we will the forever mourn their loss. We were starting your computer by the way to try Can't again. we just leave the no, interns in some choice. corner and go, Midge? No, we need to make sure that we put them somewhere where they won't get ignored. Like the middle of a street. Like a classroom. Let's find an empty one and put them there. Then someone else will find them later. All right. Well, let's find a classroom then. All right. Find a classroom. I guess a security officer normally sits here. 
Good thing they're not around. I think the security officers on this campus are all are all robots. Do they have any student work to show? No, they don't. Urgent you your exact do do do. Aw oh, man. There's totally a bag of chips there about to fall. It's one of the saddest things you can find on a college campus. Oh, almost did something stupid. Classroom hey, one. Hey everyone, it's Dr. What the fuck? Sushi here, back with only the most killer tips, tutorials, and tricks for game dev. Just got a quick lesson today about how to activate the perspective viewpoint in the very real game editor today. Just a quick one, but first, smash that subscribe button and hit the bell for updates. 13 minutes okay, later. Okay, now, before we get into it, I just want to say I couldn't have done this tutorial without the help of my boy, Squeezy Cheese 96 What up, dog? Check out his channel for more awesome game dev No, tips. we're not going to skip this. You made this. I'm going to sit here and watch it. Also, I just wanted to say, Ladrachio the Slayer, you're like super uncivil and don't know my mom at all, so nope. stop saying those Guys, things. Guys, I'm not going to skip okay. this. You're going to make... So now, we're going to sit here and this. watch what you so made. You, really you did this, not me. Camera and very real, I found this really hot trick. First, you just got to make sure your computer is plugged into an outlet. Use a grounded outlet. Never ever saw off the grounding pin and use a two prong. Trust me, okay? So you got to use a grounded outlet. Even if you have a laptop with only a two prong plug, always use a three prong outlet. It's just safer, you know? It's just good advice. Okay, the next step to activating the perspective mode in Very Real Game Editor is to turn on your computer. There's usually a little button on the side. It has a little snake eyeball. I know this is painful. You made the people know, watching this much sit users. through this because <laughs> anyway, you decided to make this thing. I am patient. Anyway, so the next step to activating the very real perspective viewpoint is to load up the very real editor. I'm not going to save these people. The these interns like have to sit through this day okay, after day. So now that we have the editor loaded, we need to find one button. It looks like this. All you have to do is click that button. Boom. Perspective view. Yeah. So yeah, thanks again to my boy Squeezy Cheese ninety six, yo boy, for showing I'm not me this. Skipping. And I hope you all learn it. I thing didn't or skip two. once. Be sure to do me a fave and smash the like and subscribe buttons, and join me again next week for more awesome game dev tips and tricks. Definitely not that room. Yeah, that's right, game developers of Bad Posture Studios. I sat there and watched your fake out video. Doesn't seem like there's anything back there. No, rubber ducky. Is this a lamp or a student art project or both? You're the one who wants to find a classroom. I'm following your lead here, Midge. It's that administrator again. She looks scarier in a cap and gown. Oh, classroom too. I think this is a water fountain. I'm not sure actually. You know, I eat cold pizza for breakfast sometimes, but not this pizza. Classroom hey, too. Kids. My name is Triangle. I'm a basic building block of 3D modeling. I'm a flat surface made by connecting three vertices in space. Ho, ho, ho. We call them verts for short. Oh, what's this? It's my friend, Engon. Why so glum, Engon? I'm sad because no one wants me around. That's true. You introduce shading errors and add imprecision to modeling. No one really does want you around. What? That's not how you cheer up a friend. Don't worry. The GPU will automatically carve you up into little triangles anyway. <laughs> oh, that's violent. Hooray! Now you're just like me. Remember, kids, sooner or later, everything turns into triangles. Hooray! Definitely not that room. You know what? You gotta be less picky, Midge. They're interns and they know what they got love into. Love little nooks like these. I would have curled up here with a good comic. I'm pretty sure this plant isn't real. Oh, I was trying to go to the bathroom. Fine. Do you think they still use books here, or do they use PDF printouts stapled together? Eh, those look like books. We're gonna check out uh, Classroom 3 first. 
This is how you properly stack any building material. Offset, Wait. see? Doesn't matter if you're using bricks, cinder blocks, Legos, or soup cans. Always offset. Learning proper construction techniques will take you far in life. Uh, maybe not that room. Well, no, actually, leave them with that room. That's a good room. He's teaching them basic construction work, which would Apply to help your them dream more. Studio every single day. You never know when someone new will see your work. Apply to your dream studio every single day. You never know if someone new will see your work. Resumes should include every app you've ever tried the demo of. Resumes should include every app you've ever tried the demo of. The best way to show off my 3D modeling skills is with a long demo reel. The best way to show off my 3D modeling skills is with a long demo reel. Actually, the best way to show off... I get a job because I have a bigger portfolio with more stuff in it. Hashtag blame a job. I get a job because I have a bigger portfolio with more stuff in it. I will spend One second, more time I gotta look at the hashtag now. than on my skills. I will spend more time networking than on my skills. Maybe not that room. But actually, the best way to show off your 3D modeling skills is to start a YouTube channel where you show off your 3D modeling skills. I gotta look up Blame Joe. I am out of the loop in social media. When analyzed with a proper academic eye, we see that this game is about so much more than just paddles and balls. Such a game is, in truth, a commentary on the environment in which it was made, a scathing critique of the oppressive nature of the Cold War, and a lament about government distrust. Is the human condition uh, one in which we are perpetually juggling both offensive and defensive positions? Is the failure of our capitalistic framework resulting in a disaffected youth? What? Or is it vice versa? These are the questions directly asked by this game, and by all games. But all right. what about Strategic Interstellar Genocide 3? That's my favorite game. Does that have a deeper meaning? That shit will rot your brain. Uh, maybe not that room. Uh, none of these rooms. Let's talk to Kevin now. Well, it's an impressive lobby. Probably spent a lot of money making it look nice. Yeah, that's how you get. That's how uh, you get a scam school off the ground. You make it look nice. But that guy was looking way uh, too deep into video this games. Seriously, their curriculum. And then they send them off to us. Oh no. The huh. hell? Cool. How about that red door? That might be a good place to leave some interns. No. Anything with a, a red Whoa. door, button, anything is like that is place? a no. It's some kind of intern hacking plant. I knew these schools were churning through students, but I had no idea it was this bad. This is fucked. Huh, there's a lot of huh. people in here. Who are you all? Hey, dweebs. What are you doing locked up? Ben? Holy crap, Frank. Hey, Viper, I used to work with that guy. I'm Viper. You can call me Viper. Frank, what the hell, man? How you been? What's with the chains, man? The what? Oh, right, the chains. Yeah, I decided to go into academia. This is pretty standard. Do you want it's me not. to, uh, uh, you know, get you down? Nah, it's cool. We get health and dental. They let us walk around an hour a day, too. That's cool. <laughs> what? Really? Totally, man. Good benefits, free parking, zero chance of having to fix show-stopping bugs at four in the morning. This is the life. Except there's no snack time. Otherwise, yeah, solid gig. So you're a teacher? Yeah, except we're not allowed to influence the lessons, but we help their accreditation rating, so they keep us here. So you're a teacher who doesn't teach. I know, it's great. Hey, Ben, you should join us. He no, will thank be you. Joining you. You, Provost West. This is a faculty-only room. You're not faculty, are you? Come over here, so I can kick the snot out of you. That's against campus regulations. I don't think you really are game developers. We sure are. We work for Shovelworks Studios. Now out of my way. I think you both need to cool off in here while I consider what to do with you. No! 
Uh, probably shouldn't have told the way we work, dude. Seriously. You know when they call some college a degree factory? I never thought they were being literal. Hey, come look at this. It looks like a test print for an ad or something. Compress four years of study into four days and prepare for your new career as a game designer. Huh. Wow, that sounds great. Where do I sign up? You are a game designer. You What's idiot. this? Phase two proposal confidential memo. Where's the rest of it, though? Hey, help me find the other pieces for this. Sure. This is definitely more important than our personal safety. We're on it, Midge. Oh, I get to play as this guy. Yeah, this guy. I forgot his name. Oh, cool. Try hug, robust internship program assembly instruction. You need 17 interns, one L uh, plank, six screws, six nuts, six washers, you need a saw hammer, and screwdriver. There we go. This door only opens when it's convenient for the plot. That's true. That's good. Rubber ducky. Can't, I can't take it with me. Okay, let's do this together, Pylon. You look for the missing Pylon. pieces of paper. I'll delegate. Here's one. Oh, that poor intern. God, this is weird. There's another piece. Can't hide from me, you inanimate object. Can't go through that door? Okay, let's talk to the intern. Phase two proposal. Proposal for what? Man, they just keep coming. Oh god. Oh, there's another duck. Give me the duck. Wow. I wonder what these machines are building. Well, doesn't look good. Radio? Hello, New England. I'm Jade, and you're listening to the Dice Bag. You're Scotch. Gotcha. Oh. Source for game, film, and culture news and talk. You hear there's a new sweaty blood game being made? They're up to 14. No, I didn't. Because I don't play sweaty blood. I don't play violent games. Good thing this yellow bar keeps me from going outside of this tightly confined but aesthetically pleasing predefined region. Yeah, sounds right. Can't hide from me, you and Huh. They're building a desk. Out of students? Yes, yeah, weird. Whatever's going on here looks really nefarious. Not practical. Not really. Cause after a while it would start to stink. All right, Mitch, I got all the pieces. Oh my God. They're planning on renting the interns out as cubicles. I can't just stand by and watch them turn all these students into cubicles. We've got to do something. Just call OSHA. Hey, let us out of here. It's no use. No one can hear you all the way down here. Hey, there's the intern. Intern. Get your ass over here! Man, be nice. Hey, intern. We need your help. We need you to get the keys. Steam keys? Not steam keys, you dolt. The keys to the door. We need you to go over and get the keys and bring them back to us. I'm not sure I know where the keys are. They're right there, hanging from that hook. You can see them from here. That's so far away. Is there a video tutorial about this somewhere? Just reach out and grab them. With a shovel? What the f with your hands? Do you even see a shovel? Are we not working right now? Just get the damn this keys already. This kid is okay, stupid. I can do this. Don't let me. Oh god, no. Oh fuck. I got to keep this job. I 
I raced the checkpoint. Nothing, kid. Oh, God, this is difficult. Oh, I'm not getting time. Okay. I got the keys. Okay. <laughs> I got the keys. Maybe they'd be better off not being game developers, Midge. Did you think of that? Hey, help me find a way to shut this down. Cubicle walls don't have to deal with crunch or internet hate or agile development. And they have way more job security. Walls are very stable. They, they... had to know they couldn't actually employ them all. The industry would be drowning in interns. Don't be ridiculous. You'd suffocate that drought. They're totally misrepresenting their career placement stats. That's a secret you will never live to tell. You again? We know all about your scam of a school. I know. I've been standing here for 10 minutes. You've seen too much. Wait. We can't let you get away. You waited 10 minutes to. We are going Wait, to 10 stop. minutes. We are. And I'm going to stop you from stopping me. Yeah, and, and we're going to stop you from stopping them from, from stopping you. Yeah. Let's you just kill think the lady. You can thwart me? Well, I looked up your little company. Your boss was one of the first to sign up. What? No way. Ha. <laughs> Jeb would never sign that. What the fuck, Jeb? What the hell? Okay, maybe he would sign that. But that doesn't change anything. Yeah, signature or not, we can't let you get away with this. Recruitus Maximus, set your missiles to kill. Viper, quick. Can do missiles do anything but kill? Grade robot. He's not ex-military. He is. I don't know, make the intern do it. Don't even joke about that. <sighs> Hold it, everyone stop. Violence won't solve anything. I never really got that. You can't not kick a robot. <laughs> oh, you think you're so tough because you took out my definitely not ex-military robot? Well, let's see how you do against all of my definitely not ex-military robots. Recruiters, attack! How are we going to do this? Destroy all robots, A swing, B switch belt directions. And I probably have more robots than you have interns. Actually, no, that's not true. Time to die. You better run. Take this. There we go. Wave two. Come on. I'm gonna die. You better run. 
There we go. Wave three. Take this. Take this. Take this. This I can do. Time to die. Right, that got difficult quick. You Two stars. Fools. My recruitment army. Without them, I won't be able to convince young and impressionable kids to sign up for our accelerated development program. Yeah, it was nothing, okay. Face it, you slimy administrator. This program is done. You can't stop me. My teacher to student ratio is superb. All my professors have terminal degrees in their fields of study. The number of times I've had sex with graduates is within acceptable limits. You can do nothing. What? Not if we have anything to say about it, Provost. Hey, Frank. You had a change of heart. Who let you out? Exercise hour is not until 3 p.m. Yeah, about that. We need to talk. Now is not the time for employment negotiations. Oh, but it is. Without us, that accreditation rating you're so proud of, that's toast. Two exercise hours. And snack time. And what more, the? Provost. Things... Things are gonna change around here. Thanks for helping us offload all these interns. It's a relief to know they're in good hands. You sure you don't want to just take some back? Interns are good to have around the office. I'll take some, sure. What? Really, Viper? You hate interns. I don't know. I could make a desk out of them or something. No, oh, we're not making desks out of them. Just one, then. A lot of snot kicking happened here today, okay? I need a memento. Oh, thanks. You won't regret it. Man, thanks Poor for intern. things, Frank. Not sure how we were gonna get out of there. It's always good to help an old friend, Ben. Don't be a stranger. Welcome back, intern. Looks like you're here for good this time. Are you sure you're okay in that crate? Yeah, I feel safe here. Well, all right. Just bounce around or something if you need anything, I guess. HR Lady Francine! Yes? Are we networking? Nope. Will I be able to work on the game now? Nope. Nope. How the hell do you not know what networking is? <laughs> See you in the next episode. Huh, I'm six. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, that was the end of three out of the 10 episode two, Terrible Posture Games. I'm liking your comedy style. We say we have a permanent intern. We killed some robots. I messed up on easy things. I'm not gonna say anything else. So we will pick this up in the next episode. I hope it'll be funnier. It looks like Midge is about to go to war. Don't know what they're gonna do yet, but uh, yeah. I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.